Hi, this is Jacob Young. I'm a second generation hat maker. And in this video, we will be going over the turban, a style of hat that me and my family make. Um, here it is, high up. This is the same style of hat pulled down low to cover the ears. This is the same style of hat again, where it's worn high up and then rolled into the tuck. So, here I'll show you how I do this. So, I first start by getting the seam of the hat, where the whole chimney of the hat is brought together and sewn into a piece. I put that at the back of the hat, and I bring it on, and I put it on high up above my ears. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this top, and I'm going to roll it with my thumbs, and I'm going to then brush it back. And that's how I'm going to get this tuck. You see that tuck there? The seam is, the bottom band is flat to the hat, but the top has been tucked over. Um, kind of like a beret. So here we go. I'm going to do the roll tuck. And there's the look. You see how much that changes the hat. See how that changes it? It really does make a different kind of hat. I like to wear it like this. But then, at other times, it is so nice to be able to pull it down low and cover my ears. So to do that, bring it back up to the high spot where it was. And I put my thumbs inside the hat. You see how I put my thumbs in there? And then I pull straight down. And then, boom, I'm way in it, and I am warm. So that works really well. Um, it's Pendleton wool on the outside and cotton on the inside. Um, it's very comfortable and really good in the cold and rain. Um, I've worn this hat as a snowboarder. I know other people that have worn this hat as a snowboarder. Um, it really is super secure and solid in the cold. Um, wool will wick moisture to a certain degree, but even if you get wet through, it'll still keep you warm. Um, another thing I wanted to show you with this style is um, the top. You see how this one has a button on top with a tassel? Well, the, t the button is part of the hat, but the tassel, you could, have it, you could have the same style without a tassel on top. See, here you go. This is that same structure, but it has no tassel. And then the other top style that we make is called an acorn top. You see here where it's got the loop. It has a loop sewn into the top of the hat. And so what that does is that you can use that and put a feather in the top or different things if you like. Um, or you could sew some beads up there or a tassel. Or you could also just leave it empty. Um, but yeah, so those are the two different types of tops we make for the turban. Well, thank you so much, and we'll see you next time.